Hey, my legion. How are y'all doing today? Um, here today to review a movie that was like a world premiere on YouTube. I guess the premiere that has over a million views called Bull Shark. Now, the one refreshing thing about this, I mean, the shark movies have been kind of lackluster. Ever since Sharknado ended, uh, there's been a couple of silly ones I like. I mean, but I mean, there's, they still churn them out. But nothing's good has come from the asylum. Two very boring movies. I remember one of that Shark S Shark SOS or whatever it was or SOS, some crap like that. Michael Madsen was awful. I couldn't watch the whole thing. And Swim, which was terrible too, a Tubi TV original by made by them. And then like the stuff from Wild Eye. I think people caught up by now. A lot of those movies are really low budget. And they don't even try, and the time they used to reuse the same crap. Sometimes it's good, sometimes it ain't. Well, the thing with this from another company called IBN, not feud with IBM, IBN Distribution. Um, and it resolve revol resolves, yeah, it revolves around a, a shark that's been found in a lake in salt water. So sharks don't like salt water. And they said bull sharks can adapt, so they said it's a bull shark. Uh, the shark is seen a little bit. I got a thumbnail right from the very beginning, and then you see a shark for a while. Um, the movie is very, very... I mean, it starts out okay, but then it gets very, very slow paced. It's like... They, the scenes are extended. To just, I mean, it's only 80 minutes. I mean, the scenes are extended to make it feel... I mean, really drag on. Um, like, scenes like the one corner girl, uh, she likes to eat the scene of her, like, mess with a paper bag. Or a scene where the sheriff and... Uh, Game Warden waiting for the coroner to show up. They talk to her, right? And they're staring, staring. They see him staring at the wall like then they, and someone asks a question after about a minute. Just long stuff like that. It's very drawn out. Um, Not much happens in the movie. There's a scene, there's a lot of scene where you see the fin. And, it, and the fin looks, I mean, the CGI is okay. The fin looks lame, right? And then the sh whenever there's a shark attack, you just see people like jerk around, or like the guy is like holding a shark. It looks fake, but not laughably fake. It's just like just lame. Uh and um, it's kind of it's not that good. Um, it's kind of boring. I probably would give this like a two out of ten. But the one nice thing is the acting is very, is actually pretty convincing. Like these guys, you actually think these guys are. Who they say they are, right? So that's a good thing right there. So I end up giving it a 4 out of 10. Yeah, I would never, I can't really, I mean, just because of the acting is above par. Not like, it's not like it's super great, but I mean, the acting, everyone's acting is very convincing. Because like the other ones, like, are really cheesy and like, or like that one girl who always looks like she's smiling, even though she's supposed to pass out, she has a big smile. Yeah, I mean, but at least the acting is halfway decent in this one. But uh, it's just so slow paced with very little payoff. Now, there is a. They're trying to be like, well, there is a mid credit scene. And then that was, I mean, the one guy that caught the shark originally, you know, it's, uh, he was okay. But I mean, if they were injecting some humor to it or something like that, it's pretty s straightforward and s serious. But just not that good. Um. Uh, Grandma Ducky, I don't know if, well, Miss Ducky, or Linda, I don't know if you want to see this one or not, but I wanted to put it out there. Another shark review in the book. Um, I try to do a lot of the shark reviews. I mean, I haven't done one in a while, so I saw this. Um, you know, it had a lot of, I mean, it was like a world premiere, and I had like over a million views. That's good. I mean, some people said the movie's better than what I thought it was going to be much better than what I saw, but. I mean, it would have been a 2 out of 10 if it wasn't the acting would have been a little bit uh, better than what I expected. I give it a 4 out of 10. So that's it from a review of Bull Shark. It's free on YouTube. And I hope you, you know, they did a world premiere on YouTube. So I hope you liked the video. Bye. Till next time, please. Camera Legion. Iggy.